and uh, this video will contain some spoilers so if you didn't watch the movie yet maybe you shouldn't watch the video uh, so the question of this video is uh, how come uh, the cybernetic hand of Luke disappeared with him when he died in the end of the movie shouldn't it have uh, fallen down just like his robe did because it's not organic matter it's not part of his body so why did it apparently disappear uh, with him some people might say that he didn't actually disappear that was simply because of the angle because we saw him from behind maybe his hand uh, did actually stay behind inside his robes but uh, then we saw his robe flying off and we didn't see or hear anything metallic uh, falling or something like that so apparently his uh, metallic cybernetic hand disappeared with him so how can it make sense uh, well first of all the force is magic <laughs> that's number one uh, we also saw you know in those telepathy scenes between kylo ren and uh, ray we saw that uh, when she was standing next to waves splashing uh, that some water appeared on kylo's face so apparently the force is able to actually teleport uh, matter uh, over great distances together with this telepathy so it's basically magic so anything can happen so that's number one it's it's a fantasy element of this uh, movie look again at the scene of yoda dying in uh, episode six and uh, you can notice that uh, actually some of his clothing actually also disappears with him only his blanket stays behind but uh, his robes actually do disappear with him and so you do have proof in the previous movies in the old trilogy that uh, inorganic matter can also disappear with you when you become a forest ghost uh, it didn't happen with obi-wan apparently at least not with all of his clothing some of it fell down but some of it maybe maybe his underpants did actually disappear with him so that he wouldn't show up naked to his friends in the afterlife you know Qui-Gon Jinn and maybe some others who learned this trick to become a force ghost so if you saw Yoda disappearing with his robes you can't really complain with Luke disappearing with some of his uh, physical belongings and uh, you know uh, he, the human body is also physical it's not like uh, it's all spiritual so if the body can disappear when you die who is to say that you cannot take your clothing with you also when you become a, a forced ghost and so maybe because he lived with this hand the cybernetic hand for so many years maybe he views it as a part of his body and so he took it with him when he disappeared uh, the question is that uh, as a forced ghost will he still have it or not that will be interesting to see in episode 9 if he will have a cybernetic hand as a force ghost i guess not because when you saw vader appearing as a ghost he looked completely human so he got rid of all his mechanical stuff and got restored into a full human so i guess luke would also have his original hand as a force ghost and uh, you can say it's all in their mind anyway it's not an actual physical thing it's more like uh, your uh, residual self-image you know just like in the matrix when neo returns to the matrix he sees himself as he used to look like because that's the way his mind views him and so that's why he appears in this way i can also give an example from the movie ghost you had that uh, train ghost who said that uh, you don't actually have a body you just uh, think you do and so it's not as if uh, you still have any physicality it's all basically an illusion and so the same i, I think goes for forced ghosts as well that might also explain the change of anakin skywalker how come he started looking younger suddenly so anyway it will be curious to see how luke looks like as a first ghost i hope it happens in the next movie so that's all i really wanted to say so people complaining about this really shouldn't because as i said yoda also disappeared with inorganic matter also no one ever said that you cannot do that uh, I, I guess it's a kind of contradiction with obi-wan because obi-wan's clothing did fall off but uh, the contradiction was between episode uh, 4 and episode 6 in the original movies so you cannot now complain if uh, someone decides to do it more like episode 6 and uh, the force is a magic power so I guess anything is possible we also seen in this same movie that inorganic matter can be teleported over this telepathic uh, line if that can happen then uh, objects can appear and disappear also I think so that's all I wanted to say about this topic let me know what you think in the comments below and I will see you all next time bye bye